Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Engineer Star. Um, this is Sandu Thapa Magar. Um, today I will solve numerical of um, open channel flow, uniform flow uh, that was asked in Purvanchal University. So, first question that was asked in uh, 2022. The question is a power canal of trapezoidal section has to be excavated through hard clay at the least cost. Determine the dimensions of the channel given. Uh, discharge is 20 meter cube per second. Bed slope 1 is to 2000 and Manning's yarn is 0.02. This was asked in 6 marks. So uh, we need to design a Trapezoidal channel section. No, yes. Uh, determine the dimension of a channel. Dimension of a channel means we have to find um, bottom width B, uh, depth Y, and the given is this. Um, Uh, given this discharge is 20 meter cube per second and bed slope yes is 1 is to 2000 and then Manning's coefficient yon is 0 0.02 mm. and here uh, the question says least cost and least cost means uh, this most economic section since the channel section has to be excavated at the least cost the section is most economic and for most economical section uh, the value of n or z is 1 by root 3 and uh, b plus 2 n y is top width top width is equal to 2 times this Mm, but this y root under unit square plus 1 is side length side length means uh, in figure this from here to here this is side length which is equal to uh, y root under unit square plus 1 so this yon will be 1 by root 3 and by solving we get b equals to 2 by root 3 times y so this is equation 1 and the area of flow is this b plus yon y y area of flow is this this is mm, this this one mm, triangle plus this triangle plus this rectangle that is the area mm. uh, since this is mm, horizontal is uh, z and vertical is 1 z can also be written as yon and this is 1 mm. <coughs> for one vertical horizontal is for one vertical horizontal is yon and for this y vertical horizontal is yon y so this is yon y and this is also yon y uh, this is b and this is y 
so um, area of this trapezoidal is area of triangle 2 times area of triangle and that is uh, C A1 plus this um, rectangle that is A2 that is 2 times area of this triangle is half multiply base is uh, n y and height is y and this area of this uh, rectangle is this b multiplied by this y b y so this 2 and 2 gets cancelled and the remaining is yon mm, y square plus b y uh, this is the total area or a of trapezoidal yon y square plus b y <coughs> So this is yon y square and this and this is by uh, b is 2 by root 3 plus yon is 1 by root 3 and y uh, whole bracket y and this root 3 comes common and 1 by root 3 comes common and 2 plus 1 is 3 uh, 3 is uh, root 3 into root 3 and root 3 is L or the D so this cancels and remaining is root 3 y square since um, here this manx here is given so uh, we use manx formula um, manx formula for discharge is q is 1 by 1 a r 2 by 3 plus yes, 1 by 2 uh, this charge is given in question that is 20 and manx is 0.02 yours is 1 by 2000 manx is 0.02 this charge is 20 this slope is 1 by 2000 and area is this root 3 by square and r for this trapezoidal channel to be most economical r is y by 2 so um, this y square and y power 2 by 3 so taking only this um, y will be common and this 2 plus 2 by 3 is 8 by 3 and so uh, by solving in calculator we get y is equal to 2.854 meter and from equation one equation one is this b is equal to 2 by root 3 y 2 by root 3 y y is this 0 0.284 so b is 3.296 so we need to find the dimension dimension is this b and this y and we can draw the figure and the next question is that was asked in 2021 in Purvansi University a trapezoidal channel so we have to design a trapezoidal channel uh, to carry distance distance is 150 meter cube per minute in one minute uh, the distance is 150 and so in one second the distance is there are 60 seconds in one minute so 150 divided by 60 is uh, 2.5 meter cube per second and uh, a water is designed to have a minimum cross section so this this is a cross section area and which should be minimum Mm. find the bottom width and depth bottom width 
is this b and depth is this d so you need to find this b and d and base slope is 1 in 1200 that is 1 divided by 1200 the side slope is 45 degree side slope is this the slope is the angle made by this side to horizontal so from horizontal it is 45 degree 45 degree uh, and changes coefficient c is 55 so this is 1045 so horizontal and vertical is in the ratio of 1 is to 1 so z is uh, 1 or you can do this 10 theta is perpendicular divided by this base perpendicular is mm, perpendicular is this this is 1 and base is uh, z so 1 divided by z and z is 1 divided by 1045 so z is 1 so the value of this z is 1 um, we have to find this b and this y and theta is uh, 45 degree in the question <coughs> for minimum cross section minimum cross section is this for this minimum cross section to design this perimeter should be minimum so uh, perimeter should be minimum so perimeter is no so for trapezoidal channel to be for minimal perimeter or um, economical most economical is top width is two times this side length so top width is b plus 2 z y is equal to 2y times 1 plus z square and z we have calculated 1 and this z also 1 so from here we get b is equal to 0 0.828 y so let it be equation 1 so what is given z is coefficient is given so from z is coefficient velocity is equal to um, c arias cross root in here arias and what this has is given so this has is equal to uh, area times velocity and area is uh, a and velocity is this c root under r yes so this q is equal to sc root under arius q is equal to sc root under arius q is uh, this 2.5 2 2 sc arius so for this economic trapezoidal section r is equal to y by 2 and uh, this formula I have already derived a is equal to dy plus y squared z and we have calculated z as 1 so a is equal to by plus y square so putting the value of a and this a and this are in equation second this equation we get 2.5 is equal to by plus y square times uh, c is 55 uh, this 55 
and r is y by 2 and yours is 1 by 1200 so from here 2 multiplied by 1200 is 2400 and this 55 divided by 2.5 is this 22 and b is from equation first b is 0.828 y b is 0.828 y and here y all this so y square and y square have done the y by 1200 so y is equal to 22 this 0. Point y square will be common and 1 it is 1 plus this 0. 0.828 is 1.828 y uh, root under y is y power 1 by 2 and root under 1200 mm. this to solve this mm. y and 2 and we need to add the power 1 divided by 2 that is uh, 2 y 2 into 2 4 plus 1 5 by 2 y 5 by 2 so y is 1.02 meter b is uh, this b is 0.828 y 0.828 y is 1.082 so b is 0.892 so this b is bottom width 0.892 and depth is y 1.082 b is 0.892 and y is 1.082 and theta is 45 degree so uh, this slope is 1 is to 1 <coughs> next question was asked in 2019 the area of cross section of flow in a channel is 8.5 meter square that is a is 8.5 meter square calculate the dimension of the most efficient section most efficient is most economical section if the channel is first triangular second rectangular third triangular both area is cross section area is 8.5 for all three cases to calculate dimensions of the most efficient section if the channel is first triangular for triangular mm, section z is 1 what is z this is 1 and if this is this horizontal is z then z must be equal to 1 for triangular so area is mm, Mm. since mm, this horizontal and vertical ratio is 1 1 so if it is y so this will be also y and this will be also y so for mm, triangle area is half base base this y and y y and height is this y so y 2 and 2 cancels so uh, it becomes y square so value of a is given 8.5 so uh, root under 8.5 is 2.915 for rectangular channel to be most efficient most efficient r is y divided by 2 root 2 this divided by 2 root 2 is 1.031 meter so depth this depth is 2.915 and uh, either radius is 1.031 and for rectangular channel this b should be twice of this y and area is this this multiplied by this by so area is 8.5 and b is 2y multiplied by y is 2y square so from here y is 2.062
and from this equation b is twice of y so twice of y is twice of 2.062 that is 4.124 and this is the required figure so depth of flow in this um, rectangular is b is depth of flow is 2.062 and bottom width is 4.124 for trapezoidal z is 1 by root 3 and b is 2 by root 3 by this i have already derived so area is by plus y square z this also i have already derived so b is this 2 by root 3 y and y here already so multiply y and y square z z is 1 by root 3 so from here y is 2.215 and b is 2 by root 3 of y so y is 2.12 so b is 2.558 so this b is 2.558 and this y is 2.215 so in conclusion depth is 2.215 and bottom width that is denoted by b 2.558 and this question was asked in 2018 mm. A trapezoidal channel has side slope 1 is to 1. So first we need to draw trapezoidal channel with side slope mm, 1 is to 1. It is required to distance 13.75 meter cube per 7. Q is 13.75 and Z is 1 since this uh, vertical is 1 and this horizontal is z is also 1 so z is 1 and bed gradient is 1 in 1000 that is 1 divided by 1000 so if online online means uh, excavation is done and there is no lining the value of z is coefficient is 44 and if lined with concrete if um, this channel is lined with this concrete then c is 60 the cost per meter cube of excavation is four times the cost per meter square of lining that is uh, for excavation the cost is four times the cost of lining if cost of lining is yox then cost of excavation is four times yox the channel is to be most efficient one or most equitable find whether the line canal or online canal will be cheaper so there is two case one is online case and second is line case to online for online case mm, we only need to excavation but in lined case uh, first we need to excavate the soil uh, and secondly we need to line with concrete so which will be the cheaper that is the question and the dimension of economical channel means this we need to find this bottom weight b and this depth of flow y For most efficient channel of trapezoidal section, uh, y plus 2yz is equal to 2y1 plus z square. So, z is 1 given in question. So, 2y into 1 is 2y, and this is written the 1 plus z square, that is 1 plus 1 square, that is 1 plus 1, this is written the 2. So, b is 0 0.28 uh, y. So area is B plus Y Z Y Z is one. So Y Z is equal to Y B is this is zero point eight two eight Y. So area is one point eight two eight Y square. For online this is given in question and in question the cost per meter cube of excavation is four times the cost um, per meter square of lining. If I consider cost of per meter square of lining is yox then cost per meter cube of excavation is 4 times x and we know 
dot j this formula q is equal to ac to the areas q q1 in equation 13.71 a we have calculated 1.828 y square c is uh, 44 given in equation for tabular section to be most economical r is y by 2 and s is 1 divided by 1000 So from here, y is 2.256 meter square and from equation first, b is equal to 0.828y, b is equal to 0.828y and y is 2.526, so b is 1.868. Then cost of excavation. Uh, to excavate to excavate the soil um, from here um, that is this is the cross section area and the volume is cross section area times uh, length So in 3D view, this will be like this. So this area is, uh, we have already calculated that it's 1.828 y square 1.828 y square is this 2.256 square divided by um, length length we assume 1 meter so this length um, this length if we assume 1 meter so length will be 1 and the cost of excavation is volume of channel into cost per meter cube of excavation that is for one meter cube volume uh, the price is 4x so multiplying this we get 37.215x and for line canal uh, this c is given and cost per meter square of lining uh, it is not given so I have assumed yox by this so this formula um, a is 1.828 y square and c is given 60 we can calculate y 1.992 meter and from equation 1 b is 0.828 times y y is 1.992 so 1.649 meter uh, cost of excavation I have already said that for line canal we first have to excavate and then we have to line cost of excavation is volume of channel into cost per meter square of excavation volume is um, area multiplied length length we assume one so area of channel is 1.828 y square one and this cost um, cost is four years given equation and we got 29.015 years and cost of lining what is the cost of lining so i will draw this is channel and cost of lining is uh, in 3d view cost of lining we do the lining in here so this is perimeter and we don't do lining in here because this is open so the perimeter is this length which is b is this plus twice of twice because here is both sides and this length inclined length is y root under 1 plus z square times length is 1 and x cost per meter square of lining we assume yox so yox is this so cost of lining is this so total cost is this 
cost of excavation 29 loss cost of lining 7 29.014 plus 7.283 is 36.298 in online channel and the cost was 37.215 and in lined channel the cost is 36 so it is cheaper line channel is cheaper the total cost of online channel is 37.215 yorks which is greater than total cost of line channel so line channel is to be most efficient so to um, if we get design job so uh, we we have to choose this because this is economical line channel is economical and it's um, diameter have depth why is this 1.992 and b is 1.649 1.992 and 1.649 and the rate of flow of water discharge through a circular channel of diameter 0 0.6 is 120 lps is liters per second so to convert liter to cubic meter we need to divide by thousand so 150 divided by thousand is 0 0.15 meter cube per second and j is c is given we need to find the slope yes so since this j is c is given we need to write jd's formula in terms of this chart it is q a c written the areas so we need to find this yes q is given in equation 0 0.15 c is also given so we need to find this area and this uh, hydraulic radius r a and r so for maximum velocity condition maximum velocity condition in this circular channel y is 0 0.81 d d is diameter 0 0.81 into 0 0.6 is 0 0.486 and this theta is um, 128.75 degree to convert it in radian we need to multiply by pi by 180 um, R is hydraulic radius is 0 0.3 times diameter 0 0.3 times 0 0.6 is 0 0.18 and perimeter is 2 R theta 2 is this 2 R is radius diameter is 0 0.6 so radius is 0 0.6 divided by 2 is 0 0.3 and theta is in radian 2.247 so perimeter is 1.348 R hydraulic radius is A upon P. R is this. Oh no, R is this 0 0.18 is equal to A. We need to calculate P is 1.348, so A is 0 0.243 meter square, and R is this 0 0.18. So yes, it's 7 into 10 to power 10 to power minus 4. So to convert in one in something, we need to divide by divide by mm, this one divided by seven into ten power minus four in calculator. One di one divided by seven into ten power minus four. That is um, around 1428.571 that is around 1429 so the slope of the bed for maximum velocity is 1 in 1429 uh, this is the question asked in 2015 the cross section of a straight river is approximated as shown in figure below uh, of a river 
mm. the river the cross section of river is this type so it will not be perfectly like this but we have approximated so we have done the straight line straight line which is shown in this figure so the dimension are given this is 5 this is 10 this is from here to here is 5 from here to here is 3 uh, at what depth will 100 meter cube per second of water flow this charge is 100 meter cube the bed slope yes is uh, 0 0.001 0 0.001 max yon is 0 0.022 so the question is at what depth will 100 meter cube per second of water flow we need uh, in here in this river 100 meter cube of water flow so we need to calculate this depth depth is y uh, so there will be two cases. This y is um, within this, within this that is from here to here, within this three meter, or it can be above this three meter. So case one is this, and case two is this. Uh, first of all, assuming this case one. Let us check whether normal depth is below 3 meter. Case 1 is below 3 meter. So, in case 1, in case 1, let it be some um, area is what uh, if the water flows in ER then the area is this 10 multiplied by this 3 that is 30 and the perimeter is perimeter or weighted perimeter is this this distance is 3 and this is 10 and this is again 3 3 plus 3 plus 10 that is 16 16 and r is a divided by b 30 divided by 60 that is 1.875 so q is equal to in here we have calculated this charge in this part that is q is equal to 1 by yon y1 this formula because Manning's formula Manning's coefficient is given so we use Manning's equation which is 1 by yon a r 2 by 3 plus 1 by 2 yon is I think given 0 0.022 0 0.022 a is we have calculated this 30 R is 1.87. Yes, it's 1 by 2. Yes, it's 0 0.001. And this 1 by 2. So, this has is 65.569. But the equation this has is 100. That is greater than this 65. So, water will. Uh, some water will flow here if um, that was if the distance in here was more than 100 then water uh, then water if the distance calculated is more than 100 then water flows here but distance is less so to 
400 meter cube per second discharge so here is how many 65.569 65.569 water flow here but for 100 additional water will flow here so the y is above this 3 let's say here this is y so first we need to calculate the area area is <coughs> area is this this area At given the charge is 100 meter cube per second which is greater than this 65 meter cube per second the, the, the normal depth is above 3 meter area is this y into y n 5 into y n minus 3 this 5 into y n minus 3 <coughs> y n is this y yon y yon minus this 3 is this much so y yon minus 3 into this 5 is uh, this area and same in here so multiply by 2 y n minus 3 into 5 into 2 y n minus 3 into 5 and y n minus 3 into 5 and this third y n is this is 10 and y n is this so this area this area so by calculating we get a is 20 y n minus 30 and perimeter is this first of all y n minus 3 mm. First of all, y n minus three. This is uh, y n. This is y n, and y n minus this three is this y n minus three, and this is y, and this is three. Y n minus three, y three, and same in here 3 5 y minus 3 and middle is 10 same in here and this middle is bottom width is 10 so perimeter is 2 y n plus 20 r is a divided by p a is 20 y n minus 3 divided by 2 y n plus 20 so Manning's equation we use q is 1 by 1 a r 2 by 3 just 1 by 2 q is distance on the given position and also given position area is this 20 y n minus 3 and this r is this 20 y n minus 3 
divided by 2 yn plus 20 power 2 by 3 power 2 by 3 and yes power 1 by 2 is the root yes is 0 0.001 so yn is 3.911 at the depth of 3.911 meter 100 meter cube or second of water will flow this should be greater than 3 so 3.911 meters so this is okay and that this question is asked in 2014 chance in 3b and in 8 marks uh, a hydraulic curly efficient trapezoidal channel this is trapezoidal channel uh, has a slope 1 is to 1 1 is to 1 uh, 1 is to 1 is this for one horizontal for one horizontal vertical is also one so this is the value of um, z so z is one 